In a recent demonstration of the highly charged atmosphere surrounding the hostage crisis, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu faced disruption during a parliamentary session. Families of hostages taken by Hamas militants heckled and booed Prime Minister Netanyahu during his address at the Knesset. <laughs> As Netanyahu took to the podium to address the country's parliament, the Israeli Prime Minister was met with vocal opposition from families of hostages. Chants of now, now echoed through the chamber as Netanyahu emphasized the need for increased military pressure and more time to free the remaining hostages. Netanyahu's address came after he visited the Gaza Strip on Monday and promised to ramp up Israeli onslaught. Shortly after his return, Netanyahu said the war was far from over. I don't know who is going to come, but if it will be the Prime Minister, I will tell him that he is responsible to what happened in October 7, and he needs to fix it, he needs to bring them back as soon as possible, because they don't have any time over there in the tunnels, and their life are in danger. And we hope that uh, they will uh, make a deal as soon as possible because we need to save them. The family members of hostages were not only inside the Knesset, they also gathered at the main gate of the Israeli Defense Ministry complex in Tel Aviv. Relatives stood next to a table set with hourglasses demanding the return of their loved ones. <laughs> My sister Romy was taken from the party on uh, October 7, and we want her back. We know that she's hurt, and we know that her wound wasn't treated, and we want her home. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.